That's communism on full display. And I just happened to see this. The folks are still marching in the streets there. And then I found this video clip of a young lady explaining what's going on. I'm going to speak in English about what's going on in Cuba because I don't hear a lot of English speakers talking about this and my generation talking about this. Cuba has been under dictatorship for 62 years. So people for naturally for the last 62 years since 1960s and 1958 around there, people started making homemade boats that we call lanchas and have bringing them to the coast of, of Florida seeking shelter. Let me explain to you why, because you might be saying, well, they're just immigrants invading because they want to leave their home country. No, it's because us Cubans, we don't complain about anything. It takes a lot for us to complain. And this, I'm sick and tired of it. So let me tell you what's going on. There's no coffins for dead bodies. If you have a dead family member, they get pronounced dead. They get wrapped in a bed sheet. You get, you get, the, you get delivered the dead body, and you have to take it home with you. What you do with the body, they don't care. You have to figure it out. If you don't have a car, they don't provide transportation and you have to take the dead body home walking. There's no drinking water. Food costs 200 US dollars. A pound of rice costs 200 US dollars. You don't want to know how much a 10 pound one costs. My favorite part. Canadian dollars is the currency of Cuba right now. If you don't have family here in the United States to give you money, you have to figure it out. You have to figure it out. Because the only way you can get money in Cuba is if you get it sent to you by here. Oh, and here, it takes months to get to Cuba. They shut off their light and water at 7. As soon as the sun goes down, your electricity gets shut. Internet is shut right now worldwide in Cuba. That's why we're not getting any new news. But we have family there. Everybody's out on the streets right now, just the same way they were yesterday. They're out on the streets right now. There's no medication, there's no Advil, there's no antibiotics, there's no butterfly butterfly needles, there's no IVs, there's nothing, there's nothing, and now is when people are hearing the screams out of Cuba. She's very upset. There was a couple of nice words.